Canada's Royal College of Physicians and Surgeons is hoping a new initiative to recognize the credentials of doctors from other parts of the world will entice them to practice medicine in the country and alleviate some of the pressure on the nation's hospitals and healthcare workers. I don't think that there are any short-term fixes to this challenge. Um, I think it's it's going to require a multifaceted approach and the on-ramp, as I like to call it, into medicine is, is just one of the potential solutions. With many hospitals here in Alberta and across Canada dealing with record high wait times for emergency room visits, surgeries and children's health care, Dr. Glenn Bandiera with the Royal College of Physicians and Surgeons of Canada tells me they are working on strategies to retain and bring in health care workers. Part of that involves streamlining the process for physicians from other countries to apply to work in Canada. Normally foreign doctors would have to go through months of assessment before writing the entrance exam. By allowing individuals to write our exams first before taking the risk of coming to Canada and entering into practice with the possibility of not passing the exam at some point. So that has uh, reduced some of the risk for individuals. Dr. Bandiera says the college has seen a 30% uptick in the number of applications, but adds that doesn't account for a two-year drop-off during the pandemic. In Alberta, the body that governs physicians and surgeons in the province says they're launching a five-year pilot project, waiving certain requirements based on exams that will allow eligible international medical school graduates to train in the field and practice medicine quickly. In Edmonton, Darcy Ropchan, City News.